Karen Garrison with A to Date VoIP Store, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Cisco NSS 3000. And you're thinking the NSS 3000? That must be some new crazy PBX from Cisco. Eh, it's not. It's not a PBX at all. It's a network attached storage device. Why would we be talking about a NAS device here at VoIPstore.com? Well, it's because we believe that you should be selling solutions, not just individual products. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, we've talked before about not just selling phone systems, but selling ancillary products like security cameras. That's a great sale to add on when you're selling a phone system. You're already working with their network. You're working with their infrastructure. It's a good time to present a product like video cameras as part of their solution. Well, the Cisco NSS 3000 is another one of those products that you can add to your portfolio that can help you increase revenue. Now, we can do this in a number of different ways. If it's a small company, they may not have a file server. Well, this is a file server. I mean, it's a network-based file server. It has user lists, access control lists. Everyone can have their own home drive, and it's just like having a Windows server. If they've got a bigger network, maybe they already have a file server. But do they have a good backup solution? With the ability to put up to four terabytes in here, this is a great backup solution because we can stuff it with drives. So depending on the situation, we can use this in our client's infrastructure. Now, what else can it do? Well, it supports uh, Samba shares and FTP. So that means most video cameras that are on the market can write directly to this device. So you could sell a handful of video cameras, go into those cameras set up, set them up for motion detection, point them to the dis this device, whether it be a Samba share or FTP, depending on the camera. And now, anytime that there's motion detected on that camera, it's writing video files to this device. That's a great way of doing this. And every device can have its own folder, so you can have front, back, warehouse, etc. So you can easily find those video clips that you're looking for. So selling the NSS 3000 is a natural fit when you're trying to sell complete solutions for somebody's network. Let's take a look at the box itself. On the front, we've got an LCD. It'll tell us the IP address, some other information about the unit, its status. We've got activity lights, activity LCDs, error lights, other different status lights on here, uh, one to turn the display on, a lock on the front so we can lock the, the cabinet shut so no one can get to the drives. And it has a USB port on the front. Now, the only thing this USB port is for, so you can put a flash drive in here and back up the configuration to that. I don't know that you'd ever really need that, but, you know, I guess it's nice to have. On the back, we've got some additional USB ports. Now, again, these aren't for uh, connecting additional drives. These are for connecting to UPS devices. So, like a APC UPS, you can take that USB cable and plug it in here. So if it detects that we're on battery power, it can smartly shut itself down and avoid any data corruption. We've got the power, a Kensington uh, locking port, and the Ethernet port. Ethernet is 10, 100, 1000. So we actually have gigabit Ethernet on this. So if we want really fast file transfers, fast backups, connect this to Giggy with the machines running Giggy, and you have got a really fast solution. Let's go inside and take a look at some of the additional specs. Now inside it has 128 megs of system memory, 256 megs of flash memory, and 150 watt internal power supply. Supports four internal SATA hard drives with hot swap capability, the 10 100 1000 ethernet port, in terms of storage, it can support RAID 0, RAID 1, RAID 5, or RAID 10, or JBOD. For file system support, it supports SMB, which is going to work with Windows, OS 10, Unix, and Linux if you're using a Samba client, NFS for Unix and Linux systems, FTP and FTPS, and virtualization. So you can actually virtualize a RAID set across a multiple chassis as long as they're on the same network. That's a very unique way of expanding 
the storage capacity of the device. In terms of security, it's got on-disk file encryption, supports VLANs, Windows-like access control lists, network filtering by MAC or IP address, and on the network it supports VLANs, quality of service, and jumbo frames to maximize the throughput of the data. The unit's available in several different configurations, from a bare chassis, two drives, or four drives, and as I said, it supports up to one terabyte drives today, so you can get a total of four terabytes. Let's take a look inside. So inside, we have the four drive bays. I can easily just pull out a drive, put whatever drive I want in it, slide it in, and lock it down. Now because it supports different RAID levels, I'm going to get different amounts of storage ability. So if I'm striping across all of them, I can get up to four terabytes today. Now it's not going to give me any redundancy. So I'm only going to want to do that if I'm using this as a backup device to primary storage, because I don't have any redundancy at that point. I can set up mirroring, so I can take two drives and just mirror them onto another two. That's going to give me up to two terabytes. Or I can go RAID 5 and go across all four, and I'm going to get three terabytes, but I'll be able to lose a drive. Now with RAID 10 I can do some additional uh, combinations in here, but the ones I'm either going to recommend are either going to be striping, mirroring, or RAID 5 to maximize your throughput, maximize your storage, and provide the redundancy. It's also got a nice little filter in the front so as air is being pulled through, it's not getting all dusty inside, trying to keep those hard drives cool, make them last longer. So again, if you're looking for a storage device, that you can sell to your customers, backed by the Cisco name, hard to go wrong with Cisco, that can support a variety of different scenarios from a small office, large office, or just as the storage device to a handful of security cameras where you can sell the storage device and a handful of cameras as a complete video surveillance system. The Cisco NS3000 is definitely an ideal product for any of those situations. So check it out at 888voipstore.com.